Hey guys, what's up? This is Nine Live Software, and today I'll be showing you how to downgrade from 4.0 to 3.1.3. So I've seen many videos on this, but none of them work. It's because you have to have an SHSH blob file, and since I did not do that, I cannot use any of those tutorials. And so if, if I was like you, this is the simplest way on how to restore back to 3.1.3, because I was very disappointed on the 4.0 firmware because it was very buggy and it crashed on me all the time. So as you can see I have 3.1.3 right here and so uh, if you guys have seen any of my other videos I have been using 4.0 and that, that was the, the, um, the actual update for 4.0 it was not the beta version it was the actual version 4.0 so I updated it and yeah and so I finally uh, restored it back to 3.1.3 I, just, I found a tutorial, like it was on a forum I think, and it was awesome. So, I'll, t I'll teach you guys what I've learned. So, all you have to do is, for a Mac, I'm using a Mac right now as you can see. So, all you have to do is just go into Finder, hold down Command, um, I'm pretty sure it's Command Option or Command sh Alt, and then press Enter. Oh, sorry, 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 com sorry um, Command Shift G. Sorry about that. And then look up dash private and press OK. So it'll give you this um, hidden file right here, private. And you go to um, etc. or etc. Scroll down so you see hosts. Double click. And all you need to do is just, as um, I'll zoom in a little bit, it's right here. And I'll, I'll have this in the description. It's 74.208. Point ten, point two four nine, space gs dot apple dot com, and I just put this right under the local host right here, and so that's all you have to do, because I don't know what I don't know what it does. I found it on a, on a tutorial or not on a tutorial but a forum, and so I just I'm been trying everything just to do it. So I just experimented it and put it in here, and it worked. So all, and then all you have to do after that, so I'm just gonna okay. So all you have to do is just go back to here. Go to I'm using text edit. Go to file, save as Western Mac OS Roman. Uncheck this box and save this to the desktop because if you save it to the actual place and you save it, it will deny it because you you don't have like the permissions. So all you have to do is just do file, save as, uncheck, go to desktop, save it, and then go back to finder, do command shift G, oh, oops, go back to that private folder, go to etc, and then just drag in hosts, and then authenticate, replace it, and then type in your password. Okay, so now it's in there. So I can quit out of that. You go to iTunes, and if you have 4.0, uh, you just download the 3.1.3 firmware. You go, um, you put your device into DFU mode, and if you do not know how to do that, you hold. Okay, so you first turn off your device all the way, then you hold uh, the home and the power button on for uh, 10 seconds, and then you just hold. And then you let go of the power button, but hold on the home button until iTunes comes up and says that your iPod is in restore mode. And then once it's like that, so here, I'll do it right now. Just give me one second. Okay, so I'm just going to pause it just now until um, I put into DFU mode, okay? Okay, so I just put into DFU mode, and I'm just going to uh, get my... Uh, video so you guys can see it and I'm extremely happy right now as you can see <laughs> I've been I, I, I hated 4.0 because it's, it's so buggy and um, I'm pretty sure Apple just rushed it because everybody started jailbreaking the 3.1.3 and so this rushed it out um, just to make make it happen so th no, th no one can get back 3.1.3 and so from here all you have to do is just um, for Mac, it's Option Restore. 
or sorry, alt restore I meant. And then just do 3.1.3. Okay, so there it is. Oh, oops, sorry about that. Okay, there you go. It says iTunes, and then it has the little um, USB port right there. So, as you can see, it is actually in DFU mode. Okay, so you just do um, Shift Restore or Alt Restore for Max. Choose a 3.1.3. Choose it, and then it will work flawlessly. And I've actually done this. I did this about five minutes ago. And so I just wanted to tell the public that I actually finished, that I actually found out a way on how to restore back. So if you guys are, if you guys need any help whatsoever, you guys can comment below. And if you guys, if this works for you, which it will, please uh, thumbs up this video and I'll, I'll also subscribe to me. So thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have fun with 3.1.3. See ya.